Okay, today we're going to install a couple of anchor pots in the concrete floor here. What we're going to install are the Champ Anchor Pots from AutobodyToolMart.com. So first, as you can see, we already have a form in the concrete. This form was made from three inch schedule 40 pipe with inspection caps on each end and set into the floor level with string before the floor was poured. So after they poured the floor, there was a skim coat over this and we just popped this with the hammer. So what we're gonna do now is cut this out. Okay, we start chiseling these out, start from this. A little bit of a production. If these were poured, well, was poured 12 years ago. Get this out. You can see there's part of the broken inspection cap. Get that out. Take this rebar, just drive it right into the ground. break the other other part you can see inside you can see how big how deep that actually is it's pretty deep go around and break the bottom of that cap. all right that is broke we get that out out of our way now we're going to try to chisel this neatly split this pipe But you're going to put Sika Flex around it in the end anyway, make it nice and neat. Lift this up. Schedule 40 pipes, even though it's old, it's still pretty tough. As you can see, we need to break it up a little more. That should be that. Peel it away. Pretty loose. Well, we don't chip off the floor anymore. We try to do this. And look at that. And as you can see, these are what we used for forms when we did the floor. There was a plastic inspection cap on each end, and then you sit them over a rebar and they sit and they stick out of the ground about this much. This floor is actually pretty thick. 
concrete here. This floor is a solid six inches or so, as you can see. That's a solid six inches plus, which is nice. Doesn't crack that way. So what we're gonna do now is vacuum out this little bit of debris. Here's the inspection caps. This is kind of how they sit. The rebar sits in there. When you set them in, before you pour, pour the floor, they just stick perfectly out. They skim coat over the top. And there's probably a good three dozen of them in this floor all over the place. So we only need a few. We've had a few in, we need a few more put in. So we're gonna put them in. Now we're gonna vacuum that hole out. Real quick. Recycled. So, here is the anchor pot, partially assembled. This is a Champ anchor pot from autobodytoolmart.com. So, you want to try to get this situated a little bit. I'm going to set it in here slightly. Just kind of tap it into place. Tap it down. Should go down easier than that. You know, sometimes a little wedge will get caught up, knock the wedge loose. Get it down even with the floor, even just the hair below. Try not to hit that. And that should be good. So no Nobody trips over it. You don't want people tripping in your garage and suing you. You really don't want that. And you want to get the wedge, the bottom part, as centered as possible, to make the pulling easier. And this one's a little off. Let's see if we can get it to center right. centered so this is the whole key to installing the anchor pots it's a plate like this so it holds the outer part in place got our wire off there this is uh, a claw hook also available from auto body tool mart so we will hook that in there There. And we're going to take our jack, we're going to hook it on there like so. And our assistant over here is going to start jacking the jack up, get some slack out of it for us. Okay, go ahead. I'm going to hold on a sec, we'll make sure this wedge looks pretty even, which it does. We'll get everything nice and even here. And let's, let's spin it around, get it away from the freshly painted car. All right, give it a couple pumps. Loosen that up and see if that holds it in place. That's 
good. You don't gotta go, it'll, it'll go. Let's pull this back a little bit and take a look at things. And it's even, it looks like it's in there. So that, we'll take care of that. We will put our cap on there. That makes it nice and easy to get the chain out later. And that anchor pot is installed. Thank you for watching. And remember, these anchor pots came from Auto Body Tool Mart. Link They're, in the description. Link in the description. And that's that. Of course, just wants to bite me now. Yeah, sometimes it's a little tricky to get on there too, especially after a long day. And there you have it. And once again, autobodytoolmart.com. Thanks for watching.